Hello everybody, The Quiet Atheist here. Now initially in the beginning I was basically going to take a couple of days off from uploading videos but I stumbled across an article today that I wanted to share with you guys as quick as possible because this article does an incredible job in regards to highlighting the bigotry that a lot of Christians in this country have to offer when it comes to dealing with the LGBTQ community. Now before we go even further as usual I want to let you guys know that this article will be in the description for everybody to check out just in case you guys are interested but I want to read a part of this article to you guys to basically shed some light on this subject so here we go cruel Christians in North Carolina leave a gay waitress a Bible verse calling for the death of homosexuals in place of a tip North Carolina waitress Alexandra Judd reports a group of women she served for lunch Tuesday morning left her a hateful message in lieu of a tip Judd posted a picture online of the bill from the group's visit to her Charlotte restaurant on Tuesday. The photo shows an abbreviation for the Old Testament verse Leviticus 2013 listed under tip. The King James Version of the Old Testament verse reads, and I quote, If a man also lie with mankind as he layeth with a woman, both of them have committed an abomination. They shall surely be put to death. Their blood shall be upon them. This is exactly what they left on that receipt, if you will, towards this LGBTQ community member. You know, this is ridiculous. This is one of the most immoral things I have ever seen, you know, for a very long time, you know. And a lot of bigoted Christians out there are actually known to treat, you know, the gay community like this because they are so morally superior, right? <laughs> These individuals are really disgusting. And this behavior really highlights, like I said earlier, the bigotry that they have to offer towards people who think differently from them, who have a different sexual orientation than them. It's totally fucking ridiculous. But I wanted to read you guys one more thing. In addition, the bottom of the receipt had a message for her as well. And it says, praying for you. Huh. These hateful messages are coming from people who think that they are morally superior because of this influence of a fairy tale. And I've talked about these things a lot before. These people are obviously ridiculous. They wouldn't know morality if it slapped them in the face. And from what this article is saying, basically, is that these group of Christian women, I guess, are known for doing a lot of these things, you know, and it's simply disgusting. It really is. You know, if I was the owner of that restaurant, you know, I would ban that group from going to the restaurant because they have no right to leave things like that on receipts for waitresses because of their sexual orientation. It's simply fucking ridiculous. It really is. And the sad thing about all of this, guys, is the fact that there are a lot of Christians out there that do this. They really have no problem leaving these nasty messages towards the LGBTQ community. They do it all of the time. The only thing is, we don't hear about all of these unfortunate situations that these people have to face when it comes to bigoted Christians. And this is a big problem in this country. I have a big problem with people who think that they can treat others any way they like. It's stupid. It really is. And I don't understand what goes through the minds of these individuals when they are willing to let a fairy tale take over their thinking. You know, it's bad. We obviously see that it's bad. You know, and hopefully one day we could see this type of thing actually stop because it's only going to be harmful as time goes on. It's going to get worse. It's going to get worse. You know, eventually somebody might get hurt. But I think, you know, that these Christians really don't care. You know, it's obvious. You know, they continue with this nonsense time and time again. And like I said, you know, maybe one day these people, you know, these Christians, if you will, would actually know what morality is all about because right now they don't and these people in question are very disgusting individuals and they had no right no right to treat this waitress the way that they did but they did it anyway because they had no respect for her and they probably never will 
these are the types of people that others need to look out for in society because they pose a great danger to society when it comes to this belief in their fairy tale. It's stupidity at its finest, guys. And I that is why I wanted to share it with you guys as quick as possible because this type of behavior is disgusting, you know, and it's something that, you know, hopefully one day will actually be extinguished. But we're just going to have to wait and see, I guess. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. I would really be interested. And thank you all for watching.